हेलो माय डियर व्यूअर्स वेलकम टू सिंपलीफाइड सिविल एंड जियोटेक्निकल इंजीनियरिंग चैनल आई एम अक्षय जायसवाल इन दिस वीडियो आई एम गोइंग टू एक्सप्लेन प्लेन सेडिमेंटेशन सेडिमेंटेशन विथ कॉगुलेशन एंड ऑब्जेक्टिव्स ऑफ सेडिमेंटेशन सो लेट्स स्टार्ट टूडेज लेक्चर चैप्टर नंबर टू प्यूरिफिकेशन ऑफ वाटर नाउ लेट्स सी सेडिमेंटेशन टैंक्स नाउ वी विल सी सेडिमेंटेशन प्रोसेस if water contains suspended impurities of larger size it is very economical to remove them by the preliminary sedimentation means pani mein maujood suspended impurities ko yadi hata diya jata hai to water purification ki kimat mein katauti ki ja sakti hai this picture shows sedimentation process and settled particles this picture shows suspended impurities point number 2 the suspended impurities make water turbid therefore when suspended impurities will be removed load of further treatment process is reduced yani pani mein maujood suspended impurities ke karan pani ko ashuddha kaha jata hai suspended impurities ko yadi hata diya jaye to water purification ki aage ki process aasan ho jati hai point number 3 hence all particles having more specific gravity than liquid will move vertically downward due to gravitational force this is the main principle of sedimentation yani aise particles jinki specific gravity pani se zyada hoti hai wo particles gravitational force ke karan niche ki or badhte hai isi process ko principle of sedimentation kaha jata hai point number 4 Sedimentation is the process of reducing turbidity of water by removal of suspended impurities so that the suspended impurities may settle down at the bottom due to force of gravity yani sedimentation ek aisi process hai jahan suspended impurities ko hata kar pani ki turbidity ko kam kiya jata hai jahan gurutvakarshan bal ke karan pani mein maujood ashuddhiya niche ki or chali jati hai now we will see our next point that is objective of sedimentation point number a to remove suspended impurities from water in large quantity point number b to lighten the loads on subsequent process point number c to reduce the turbidity of water point number d to make sand particles or impurities settle down at the bottom due to force of gravity point number e to give treatment to raw water these are few examples of sedimentation tank now we will see our next point plane sedimentation point number 1 the suspended particles present in the water are difficult to remove as particles contains numerous impurities as a result of this turbidity increases point number 2 plane sedimentation is the process of removing suspended matters from water by keeping them at rest in tanks so that suspended matters may settle down at bottom due to force of gravity yani plane sedimentation process mein pani ko sthir rakha jata hai जिससे सस्पेंडेड इंप्यूरिटीज नीचे की ओर चले जाते हैं नाउ वी विल सी एडवांटेजेस ऑफ प्लेन सेडिमेंटेशन पॉइंट नंबर ए इट लाइटन्स द लोड ऑन सब्सिक्वेंट प्रोसेस मतलब ये कि सेडिमेंटेशन प्रोसेस इंप्यूरिटीज हटाकर आगे की प्यूरिफिकेशन प्रोसेस पे आने वाला प्रभाव कम करता है जो प्यूरिफिकेशन के अगले प्रोसेस को आसान बनाता है पॉइंट नंबर बी 
the cost of cleaning chemical coagulation basin is reduced. Point number C. No chemicals are lost with sludge discharged from plain settling basin. Point number D. Less quantity of chemicals are required in subsequent treatment process. In sub ka matlab hai ki sedimentation process mein chemicals ka loss nahi hota hai aur isse aage ki sari process mein lagne wali chemicals ki matra kam ho jati hai. Now let's discuss about process of plain sedimentation. Point number one. In the process of treating the water by plain sedimentation, water is retained in the basin so that suspended particles may settle down due to force of gravity only. Yane, plain sedimentation process mein paani ko sedimentation tank mein sthir rakha jata hai. Jiske karan suspended particles gurutvakarshan bal ke karan sedimentation tank mein niche ki or chale jate hai. Point number two, after settlement of suspended particles has taken place, the water is taken out from basin without causing any disturbance to suspended impurities. Yane, suspended particles ke settlement ke baad, upar mojud saaf paani ko alag kiya jata hai aur nichli satah pe mojud suspended impurities ko sthir rakha jata hai. Point number three, plain sedimentation is suitable for relatively pure water which contains undesirable amount of suspended impurities. Point number four, practical experience has shown that water containing large amount of suspended matters can be easily clarified by sedimentation. Point number six, sedimentation with coagulation. Necessity of sedimentation with coagulation. Point number one, very fine suspended particles are not removed by plain sedimentation. Plain sedimentation process ke zariye, fine suspended particles ko hatana kafi mushkil hota hai. This picture shows very fine suspended particles. Point number two, silt particles of 0.06 mm size requires 10 hours to settle in 3 meter deep plain sedimentation tank and 0.02 mm particle will require about 4 days for settling. Matlab, jinka size 0.06 mm hai, aise particles ka 3 meter gehre tank mein settlement karane ke liye 10 ghante tak ka samay lag jata hai. और जिनका साइज 0.02 mm है ऐसे पार्टिकल्स का सेटलमेंट कराने के लिए 4 दिन तक का समय लग जाता है पॉइंट नंबर 3 दिस सेटलिंग टाइम इज इम्प्रैक्टिकेबल बिकॉज़ वाटर कैन नॉट बी सेटल्ड फॉर सच अ लॉन्ग टाइम यानी इतना ज्यादा समय दे पाना काफी मुश्किल हो जाता है जब हमें लाखों लीटर पानी को प्यूरीफाई करना होता है पॉइंट नंबर 4 व्हेन मैटर कंटेंस सच फाइन क्ले एंड कोलाइडल पार्टिकल्स it becomes necessary to apply such a process which can easily remove these colloidal particles from water. Such impurities can be removed by sedimentation with coagulation. Yane, jab paani mein clay or colloidal particles maujud hote hai, tab ye process karna zaruri ho jata hai, jis se colloidal particles ko paani se bade hi aasan tarike se alag kiya ja sakta hai. इस तरह के इंप्यूरिटीज को हटाने के लिए सेडिमेंटेशन विद कोगुलेशन प्रोसेस का यूज किया जाता है। होप यू लाइक द इनफॉरमेशन गिवन इन दिस वीडियो। इफ यू आर वाचिंग माय चैनल फॉर फर्स्ट टाइम देन क्लिक ऑन सब्सक्राइब एंड शेयर विद ऑल योर फ्रेंड्स। थैंक्स फॉर वाचिंग जय हिंद वंदे मातरम।